It's time for another episode of Pressing Before and After. My name's Jim, I'm with CGC Sports Illustrated, and in this series of videos I show you examples of uh, issues, comics, and magazines that I'm working on, either my personal collection or for my customers, and I walk through the before and after of the pressing process, showing you the flaws and then showing you the end result of those flaws being fixed by the pressing process. This is a really interesting episode because this specific piece that I dive into was actually pressed by CGC first, slabbed and graded. I got it back from CGC and was unhappy with the results. So I crack it, press it, and then we'll ship it back over to CGC for regrading. So check out this week's episode. Oh, and if you're interested in my magazine and comic cleaning and pressing service, uh, drop a comment here on YouTube. Find me on social media. I'm on every single platform. Same username is here, CGC Sports Illustrated. I really like this issue. This is Time Magazine. It's Barack Obama. It's from November 24th, 2008. So this would have been right after he won the election, but before inauguration. You can see it's graded there 9.4 and if you can tell by the front and back label, this one was graded a long time ago. I'm going to guess this was probably like a 2016, 2017 when this one was graded. Um, it is 9.4. I bought this slabbed as is, but I'm going to crack it, press it, and resubmit it for grading. So let's take a look at, uh, at how we do that. I'm going to crack this one right now, and then I'll come back and pull it out of the soft plastic sleeve. Let's crack the slab on this one. And so if you've never cracked a slab before, this is what lo it looks like on the inside. This is kind of a soft plastic sleeve that it's in. Um, and this sleeve will look different depending on when your issue was graded because they changed a little bit over the years. This is one of the really older ones. So now I've got to remove it from the soft plastic inner sleeve, and then we can press it. Now that it's out of the soft inner sleeve, I can get to prepping this and pressing this. I know I say this all the time, but save these and mail them back into CGC. That is what a good, upstanding, responsible member of society does. It's important that the census stay as accurate as possible. So when you crack one of these, you should save this and then mail it back into CGC. I usually wait until I get about 15 or 20 of them and then send them back in. All right, let's take a look here and see what kind of flaws we can find. I know. So, so right there, right there, we've got a little bit of a spine tick. Doesn't break color, but still a spine tick. Got a small finger bend right there. I mean, there's a reason it got a 9.4. It's pretty clean. Ooh, there's one right there. Little tiny bend right there on the back. Let's see if we can see it. Right there is a finger bend. And then here's the big dog. Corner crunch right there at the bottom. Um, and a little bit of a, of a crease right there. So those will be the areas I'm going to be concentrating on. Those are the flaws that I think I can fix and upgrade this to hopefully a 9.6, really hopefully a 9.8. Uh, I'm going to throw this in the press. We'll let it sit for 24 hours, and then we'll come back and take a look and see if those flaws are gone. This is our end result. So I ran this through the presses a couple of times because that corner crunch on the back was giving me a hard time. So let's recap those flaws that we looked at before. We saw that spine tick up there. That's completely gone. We saw that little bit of a uh, finger bend there. That's gone. Very clean on the front. You can see no flaws, no finger bends at all. Now let's check a look at the back. We had that dent there. That's gone. And this was the tough part. So let's see if I can get the light on this here right and bring it up close enough. That was where we had the corner crunch, right there. And that's what took a couple of times through the press for it to come out complete and nice and clean. But this is what we've got now. Just an absolute great looking copy of Barack Obama and his Time Magazine cover. And now what we're looking at here is this has a really decent shot. I'm hoping at a 9.6, fingers crossed even for a 9.8. Next step is I will send this off to CGC for grading and we'll see this copy in a future unboxing video. Again, if you're interested in my comic and magazine cleaning and pressing services, uh, drop a comment here on YouTube, find me on social media, DM me over there. I've got the same username on all social media platforms. It's the same as here, CGC Sports Illustrated, and really appreciate you watching. Thanks so much.